Introduction to Work Order Management Work orders are the core to dispatching and scheduling. In this section, we walk through the details of work order management. Desktop Work Orders Work orders are listed in the order section. In the list you can filter and search the specific work order and click to open any item. Notice that you can select the visible columns under the Actions menu to view only the relevant data from each work order. Each work order has the following sections. Customer Information General Information Materials and Jobs Customer section lets you choose the customer and attach a contact to the work order. You can also assign a different bill to customer. Products are items consumed on the jobs and can also be used to invoice separate materials or services. Start typing any product and the automated search will help you select a product from the registry. Each work order can have one or multiple jobs. This is important as the jobs are the items you will later schedule and dispatch to your field technician. Please note that you can customize the work order content with the quick wizard. After saving, the jobs are available on the dispatching board and the mobile ones published. Here is the dispatcher view. And here is the job at the mobile. You can also start new work orders by double clicking on the dispatcher on any available resource at a specified time or use the quick menu on the right hand corner. Now the next step is to look at the dispatcher and see the work orders in action. Thank you for watching.